normally I don't let videos like this get to me. And right now I'm going through all this camera bullshit, so I really don't want to be making no videos right now at all because of the quality that I'm getting off these video cameras. So let me go ahead and try to manipulate this real quick one time before I do anything else. Um, it's a damn shame because here in the state of California, we have just uh, changed the laws here, so to speak. And when you change the laws, you know what happens. Shit goes down and things change. Let's see. I'm trying to make sure this shit works and do the video at the same time because I'm not going to be fucking around with these videos if they're not going to do what they're supposed to do. Now, I just checked this video out and the young man is getting a year in jail and then on top of that, five months, five, five years probation for having sex with this underage girl. Now, if you watch this video, the girl states that she's uh, 18 years old, and on her MySpace page it says she's divorced. Um, in California, the new law states that um, if a woman is, you know, raped or anything happens to a woman, just say she accused a guy of doing something, she does not have to testify anymore. So what does that mean? That means that if I was a female and I didn't like this guy I was going out with and, you know, I'm just tired and don't know how to break up with him, I can say he beat me or he raped me and never have to go say this again. In other words, I can just say, you know what, this guy raped me um, because I was going to break up with him and, you know, blah blah the person the accuser does not have to go to court does not have to recant a re they don't have to tell the story twice in other words they can say you did this or that and uh, that's it you're accused once you're accused the district attorney can take the case and bam you're done. That's it. You have people who weren't there quoting things that aren't true, and you're done. You're done. And in this video, this guy is not the only guy that's been arrested for having sex with this girl. The first guy apparently got five years for having sex with her. And she said she was old enough. She said. And, you know. Society is just so fucked up now. Um, you know, it's sad when someone can purposely lie and it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter that, you know, the girl lied. It just doesn't matter. It just, that That is not even part of the equation. The fact that she lied, so what? You had no business messing with her in the first place. You're going down and that's the bottom line. They're sending you down the river and no one gives a fuck. You cannot prove your innocence. You cannot fight these these accusations. Because if you can't face your accuser in a court of law, then you're just gonna be accused. You have a team of people saying you did something. And then, well, she was too scared to show up. She didn't want to show up. She didn't have to show up, so she didn't show up. Whenever an accusation can get you put in prison, all is lost. And now that the accuser don't even have to show up, what does that mean? That means now when you get in an argument with your girlfriend and she called the police, uh, he wouldn't let me leave out of the house. That's false imprisonment. You can go to jail. And she don't have to show up in court one time to say anything. Now, let's see if this law is going to run both ways. Let's see if a man accuses a, a woman of something. Will he have to show up in court? And go, there she is right there. See, people in this state and in other states are at a rush to judgment. What I mean, at a rush to judgment, 
is this. If I want to say you did something, I can say you did it. And no one is going to check to see if I'm telling the truth or not. And that is what's scary. That right there. No, no one checking to see if anything is true. That's sad. And that shit is going to go down. And this video just goes to show you that the power of words, actions, are no longer in your control. Like I said, whenever someone can accuse you of something, and in this video, this person did not accuse this man of anything, or any of the other guys of anything. No one accused these guys of anything. They did it. They had sex with this girl, and she's underage. She didn't tell them. Uh, she lied about who the fuck she was, what really was going on, and they're going to jail for it. What is she going to do? Get back on MySpace, trick another piece of dick over, have sex, and then he'll probably end up going to jail too. This shit has got to stop. I mean, promiscuous people, period. If you're underage and you're trying to get your fuck on, there need to be a disclaimer. I'm sorry. Yes, I had sex with this person. Yes, I'm underage. And I asked for it. I want to have sex. Make somebody sign something because people shouldn't have to go to jail when the other person having sex with you is lying. She laid down with him, but she got up, went and took a shower. He got up and went to jail. I think that's not fair. Um, we can take this a step further. Say, for instance, this girl gets pregnant by one of these many guys who she's tricked into having sex with. They got to pay child support. Should they have to pay child support if she doesn't say anything and all of a sudden she has a baby? People fail to realize how many times that shit goes on. I'm pregnant. I haven't had sex with you in almost a year. Come on. Get a life. Well, it's your baby. And you paying child support for it. And that's it. And nobody says nothing. And you looking at this guy like he's some old dirty bastard. Because he had sex with this girl. Now he don't want to help her take care of her kid. If he don't know she pregnant... All of a sudden, oh, it's your baby. There need to be some controls placed upon people who have body parts who don't know how to control them. In other words, if you're going to go out and act like an adult, you need to be treated like an adult. If you're going to go lie about your age to have sex, then you should have to pay for the consequences of that. People who have sex with people shouldn't have to go to jail once they find out that the girl is too young. How come didn't nobody tell me how she was when I was fucking her? Stupid shit. And a man, for the men out there, if you don't know what you're doing or who you're doing it with, you shouldn't be able to have the power to be doing it either. That's the bottom line. Hopefully this video comes out because if it don't, I'm either going to start calling YouTube or I'm going to go through this computer one more time and erase all of these programs that I have that I need just to see if I can get this shit fixed. So, what I always say at the end of the videos, you.